What's going on guys, this is Sam, and today we may have gotten the craziest WWDC leak ever. We have a full preview of macOS 10.14, dark mode, new wallpaper, new version of Xcode, Apple News on the Mac. There is so, so much to talk about in this leak, and um, I'll leave a link to the source down below. This is discovered on Twitter uh, by Stephen Trotten Smith, so go ahead and check his Twitter out and follow him. He always gets good Apple scoops like this, and this is all 100% legit. Legit. Apple recently took down the video, but the video was hosted on their website. So this is 100% confirmed what macOS 10.14 is going to look like. All right, let's go ahead and jump in. So this is the official video right here. This is macOS 10.14. Apple is going to announce this alongside iOS 12, watchOS 5, and tvOS 12 on Monday, June 4th at WWDC 2018. First thing I notice, Xcode has a dark appearance. This is our first look at Xcode 10, the next generation version of Xcode. This is how developers make apps for iPhone, iPad, Mac, Apple Watch, Apple TV. It's all done through this program. And it's got a dark mode now, which lines up with what we've heard in the past, which is that macOS 10.14 will likely have a system-wide dark mode feature, which is very exciting. Now, this part is speculation, but if you notice in the video, the iOS app that the uh, user is playing around with also has a darker grayish appearance. Now we don't know if dark mode's coming to iOS, but to add more fuel to the fire, to get you even more hyped up, probably only to be let down, uh, we got this tweet on Twitter earlier today from, I know I'm gonna mess up his first name, so I'll just say G Rambo. G Rambo shared this on Twitter earlier today. If you ask Siri right now to disable dark mode, uh, Siri says that she cannot disable that feature. Almost like it would be coming to iOS 12. Like I said, there's no actual source data or video to back that up, but the video in, in this Mac OS 10.14 leak features a dark mode looking iOS app. And if you ask Siri, she references not being able to turn off the dark mode setting. So who knows, maybe after what, 11 or 12 years, we finally get a dark mode with iOS 12. Of course, if that happens, I'll be sure to post videos here on the channel. So make sure you are subscribed for that. Next up in the video, I noticed the wallpaper in the back and I'm so frustrated that we don't get a better look at it. I would say this is like the perfect tease, the perfect leak though, because it looks like it's gonna be really great. We just can't actually see like the focal point of the image. We heard a couple weeks back from Mac rumors, they found some, I think, trademark filings in a few countries and Mojave was filed and MacRumors hypothesized that because that one was filed in both of the countries they looked at that it could be macOS 10.14 Mojave this year. And looking at this, these look like darker sand dunes at, at dusk or at nighttime, which could match the night mode. And I was reading an article from 9to5Mac and they hypothesized that there could be a wallpaper uh, like the light version of macOS and then this wallpaper for the dark version. But I am so looking forward to getting my hands on this. It looks like it's going to be a great wallpaper and I, I think, uh, I really feel that this confirms the fact that macOS is going to go to the desert this year and it will be macOS 10.14 Mojave. Now we just have to wait and see what wallpapers are coming to iOS. We haven't seen any crazy iOS leaks like this, but there is even more to talk about. Going back to the video once again, look at the dock at the very bottom. Do you notice anything a little bit different? Yes, of course it is dark but look at the Apple News icon. As of right now, Apple News is not on the Mac, but this is confirmation 100% that Mac OS 10.14 will have an Apple News app. This is something that people have wanted for a long time. Although I don't use Apple News a lot, being able to view it on my desktop in addition to on my iPhone and my iPad, I think it's gonna be a really cool feature. Now while most of the other icons on the dock have not changed, Apple News is the only new one. Take a look at the trash can right here. It looks like if you enable this system-wide dark mode option that should be coming uh, to Mac OS 10.14 in just a couple of days, it will actually turn the trash can uh, dark or space gray if you are using the dark mode, which is really tiny attention to detail, but it's also something that Apple's known for and that adds a little bit of flavor to the dock. So I think that's a really cool Easter egg right there. So besides those changes, that is everything we can gather from this short video. I mentioned earlier this was discovered by a developer. It was officially placed on Apple's website and it has been taken down now, but the way this was discovered is it's actually an App Store preview video. So on macOS right now, macOS 10.13, it's got the same traditional 
app store that it's had for a long time. So you can only see screenshots where on iOS, uh, on iPhone, on iPad, you can go to the app store and view video previews of any app that you want to download. That was a new feature with the brand new app store on iOS 11. So Steve TS, who discovered this, said that that should also be coming to the Mac now, video app previews for Mac applications. And this adds more validity to the Darian Fireball claim a couple weeks ago that said Mac OS will be getting the iOS 11-esque app store redesign treatment where there's going to be featured apps and games and apps tabs. I mocked up what it could look like right here. So that should also be coming, a redesign app store in Mac OS 10.14. I still can't believe that this actually leaked out. Every year, Apple says they are going to clamp down on leaks. Uh, at the same time, there's also not like insane features that we didn't know about already. We had heard about a redesign app store. We had heard about a dark mode. Uh, just seeing it in action definitely looks very cool. And we didn't know for sure that it was going to be Mac OS 10.14 Mojave, but based on the wallpaper and what the rumor mill has suggested, what Apple's filings have suggested, it's probably going to be Mac OS 10.14. Mojave. I'd love to hear your thoughts on this down below. Do you think we'll see something like this leak for iOS 12? Uh, I definitely highly doubt it, but who knows? WWDC is just about 48 hours away at the time of recording this video. iOS 12, macOS 10.14, all of Apple's new software will be in our hands very shortly, uh, and I cannot wait to check it out for myself. So if you enjoyed this video, if you noticed anything else in the video that I missed, leave a comment down below and drop a like if you enjoyed watching or if you learned something new and hit subscribe so you don't miss out on any of my videos in the future on new macOS or iOS leaks. If you want to help support the channel, you can head over to patreon.com slash update and donate there. That would be amazing or buy a t-shirt like the one I'm wearing right now over at shop.ifdidos.com. I've been Sam. I hope all of you are doing great and I'll talk to you in my next video.